Hello and welcome back to the Yamanote. Alex here as we get ready to depart from Sinagara Station driving a E233-1000 series train on a Kaisoku. That's a rapid train service bound for Omiya. And we are on the Keihin Tohoku line and well, today I'm playing Dance at the Go, Hashiro Yamanote-san on the PlayStation 4 with the Suiki train controller. All the doors are closed, safe to depart now. Shupat Shinko. The part will clear and we are departing under the snow, so let's get the wipers on. It's been a couple of snowy rides here in the Yamanote with that Hakodate tram ride and also with the Hakita Shinkansen. And well, we have an upcoming 60 rolling speed check and a 70 speed limit. So let's get up to 60 and try to keep it there. And we sound the horn for those various workers under the snow near the train depot. And that's an upcoming 40 speed limit just before entering the next stop that will be Takanawa Gateway Station. With that impressive main hall. I look at that. It's beautiful. Well, we are coming to the stop, so let's start breaking here. We have 10 seconds now. All right, and that's one second ahead of a schedule and 31, 31 centimeters. That's a nice stop in the newest station in the Keihin Tohoku line and the Yamanoto line too. The Takanawa Gateway Station that opened in 2020. And it's part of a enormous urban redevelopment plan by JR East on the old train depots that were located between Sinagawa Station and Tamachi Station. So you can see that to the right there's still a train depot, but everything on the left is being redeveloped with buildings and parks and... Oh, and look at that! A uh, 189 series train on the Tokaido main line. Oh, impressive. And well, we have a 45 speed limit and an upcoming 40 speed check. But yeah, all this area is being redeveloped with the Global Sinagawa Gateway project. It's a big name for it. Right, that's a 40 speed check that we clear. And you look now in the horizon, you'll see the Tokyo Tower in red and white as we get a upcoming 60 speed limit and an upcoming 55 rolling speed check so let's go up as close as possible to 50 here in order to be ready for that 55 rolling speed check all right and let's keep it there Ooh, careful here like that, a bit more. And a rail fan, a dedicated rail fan under the snow. Let's say hello to him. Well, we have now an upcoming 50 speed check just as we enter Tamachi Station. So we get that 50 speed check. Uh, let's go here to the stop on Tamachi Station. going to start braking. Watch out for the keys. Nine point six centimeters. One second late. Ah, good stuff and ah, how beautiful is the E233 series. Hmm. 
nice design. So nice that it actually won the Laurel Prize for the best design introduced in 2007 by the Japan Rail Fan Club. But yeah, it really is. I mean, all the I've been talking lately of Kenji Ekwan, but really all his designs for JREs were amazing. They really have a distinctive, they help it to create a distinctive personality for JREs after the privatization. Well, all the doors were closed, safe to the part now. She put Shinko from the 209 series to the all the Narita Express trains, the E2 31 series and the E2 33 series that we are driving now. Well, we have a 65 speed limit, 55 rolling speed check. to keep it there at 55 and we move towards Hamamatsucho station careful there not coming 70 speed limit so let's get some speed here and dim the lights for that other Keihin Tohoku line train and we have a 60 speed check We can see the Tokyo monorail tracks to the uh, right. Upcoming 65 rolling speed check and a 75 speed limit. All right. Keeping it there, just as we enter Hamamatsucho station. Let's start braking here and the conductor just reminded us that this train doesn't make a stop in Simbasi and Yurakucho. This is a rapid train. All right. We'll coast from here and just delete the lights for the Yamanote line train and 14.8 centimeters, one second late. But I think we are doing a nice time here. But yeah, this train doesn't make a, a stop at Simbasi and Yurakucho. The next stop will be Tokyo Station. Um, thanks to the Keihin to Hoku line mm, moving to the left of the Yamanote line tracks, we can do now um, cross platform transfers between the Keihin Chohoku line and the Yamanote line. And this is especially important because the Keihin Chohoku line connects Yokohama, Kawasaki, Tokyo and mm, Omiya. <laughs> Omiya, yeah, we are bound for Omiya. <laughs> Sorry there. Because uh, there's a problem with Dance Go. It never goes to Omiya. <laughs> Only in Dance Go Professional Two, but yeah, since the Keihin Chohoku line connects those um, big cities, it's important that when we get into the Yamanote line, we have an easy transfer in order to get to the other points around Tokyo that the Yamanote line reaches. A big word explanation there. Sorry. <laughs> All right, we have an upcoming 65 rolling speed check and an upcoming 80 speed limit. Uh, let's get some speed here. Because next we'll be passing through uh, Simbasi station. And some GRE workers there. And this is our rolling 65 speed check. And an upcoming 60 speed limit. And dimming the lights here for that 189 series train. We prepare to pass through Shinbasi. Oh, and we are a little late here. So let's go up to 60. 
bit more. All right, one second behind the schedule. That's manageable. And we have an upcoming 50 speed limit. And the the light for that K hint of a good uh, line train. Ooh, too much going on, but this is a daily roulette mission, a four star difficulty daily roulette mission. So, of course, a lot of things to keep track of. And this is a 70 speed limit, upcoming 60 speed check. And an upcoming 90 speed limit. Next stop is Tokyo, and before that we will be passing through Jurakutsu. And look at that on the right, uh, 185 series train. And we have a 75 a speed check that we are able to clear. Let's gain some speed here because we are a little behind the schedule. And we have an upcoming 80 speed limit. All right. Let's go here as we see the Tokyo International Forum to the left. Upcoming 75 speed limit and a 70 rolling speed check. All right, let's keep it there at 70 and look at the Tokyo Station building under the snow. Wow, it was beautiful. And actually, that was kind of my motivation for doing this run. Because, well, first let's make a stop here on platform 3, Tokyo Station. This is serious business driving. Alright, 9.2 centimeters, 2 seconds late. And now we can talk. <laughs> but yeah, um, uh, last week I saw pictures of Tokyo under the snow, and there was a beautiful picture of the Tokyo Station, the Marun Marunochi Exit Building. I actually retweeted that on my Twitter account. And seeing that, it was like, oh man, I, I really want to drive under a snowy Tokyo and that's what we are doing today thank you to Densarego Hashiro Yamanote-san well now we are under the cover of Tokyo Station but we'll go into the snow as we depart Tokyo Station all right all the doors are closed safe to depart now Shupat Shinko, the party in Tokyo Station. We have an 80 speed limit. Um, there to the left, you can see the Chuo line tracks. Chuo line that goes all the way to Nagoya in JR Central territory. Right, we have an 85 speed limit, upcoming 65 rolling speed check. And the next stop will be Kanda. Let's try and keep it there at 65. Like that. An IT speed limit now. Well, let's say hello to those GRE's workers working under the snow. That's tough. All right, we have a 75. Let's keep check. And a 75 speed limit. Just after that, I'm entering now into Kanda Station. Okay. Careful here. A bit more, a bit more. Like that. All right, two seconds late. 20.5 centimeters. How uh, do we keep it rolling there, here? And you can see the snow there. And um, it's one thing that I really like about 
this game on is how well the, the snow and rain effects are done. Like nothing that you have seen before in a Dance of the Go game. I, I'm going to turn the wipers off for a moment. So you can see the snow on the windshield. All those little snowflakes. Oh. All right, all the doors are closed. Safe to the part now, Kanda Station. Shupat Shinko. The part will clear. And you can see there the Chuo line making a turn. And the next stop will be Akihabara. And by the way, next to, well, rail fan over here, over there. 60 speed check. And to the right, we can see the Tohoku Shinkansen tracks. Right, we take clear of that. We take care of that 60 speed check. Upcoming 70 speed check. Upcoming 60 speed limit. It's going to be close. 70 speed check. 60 speed limit. And what's out there? Oh, you have to be careful. Let's make the stop here in Akihabara. 10 seconds now. Okay, coming to a stop. Hmm. Not the best stop, but we managed to make it under the safe limits. There we have it. In Akihabara Station. But if you are a follower of the Yamanote, you know that this one station that is really close to my heart. Because all the incredible things that are around. Like, for instance, one interesting thing is that building there is to the left. That's the Akihabara UDX building. And why it's interesting? Because if you go into the parking deck of the UDX building, wow, the cars that you are going to see there are incredible. Like all the cars from the tuning scene and also around the building. And also all the cars of the Itasha is seen, you know those, well, 85 speed limit, 75 speed limit, 60 speed check as we move towards Ueno station. All right. But yeah, the Itasha cars are those cars that are decorated with anime stickers, uh, especially of the waifu <laughs> type. Uh, we have an upcoming 80 speed check. Mm. Oh. All right, ooh, ooh, ooh. we are late here. Let's focus for a moment. Let's get that 80 rolling speed check. Upcoming 75 speed limit. Upcoming 65 rolling a speed check. Uh, a speed check, sorry. All right, I'm coming into Ueno Station. As we pass through Okachimachi. All right, 15.0 centimeters, one second late. Sorry, but at the end, I just had to focus in order to offer the passengers of the Keihin Tohoku line 
uh, the kind of traveling experience that they want. <laughs> and yeah, sorry, sometimes I... Oh, look at that! A trophy! <laughs> That's nice, that's great way right? to uh, to end this round with a mission clear too. Uh, let's see. S S A S uh, that's an S ranking. So yeah, uh, <laughs> sorry about the end, it was hmm, a bit tumultuous, but we get it done, we get a nice ranking, and I hope that you have enjoyed this snowy round on the Cave in Tohoku line. Um, well, you know, if you have liked it, please subscribe, like everything. I do one line every week. Um, thank you again for coming, and until the next time, thank you for traveling with the Yamanote, and have a nice rest of your trip. Bye.